what I strive to be, the reason why I do streaming in general, being a content creator. I was inspired by a certain someone who is not with us anymore. And that was one of the biggest pushes. I always wanted to be a YouTuber as a child because it seemed like a fun thing to do. And I learned about streaming thanks to that one guy. I will not mention today. That's a topic for another time. And he was the biggest motivator for me. Imagine if I had the spark of interest. That guy made it erupt like a volcano. That's how much, that's how important he is to me. And well, it's no one I know personally, not at all. Just someone I was looking up to. I really enjoyed and since he's not here anymore, I want to just go on a journey that really fueled me like crazy. I want to be there for others, just like how he was there for me. I want to give that feeling as well. This has been one of the biggest reasons why I'm here right now. The other part, the other half of it is because I I always wish to have an older brother to play games with together and be there for me. And you know, an older brother who can help me with games, show me new games to play. As a child, I was like very picky with games, you know? Nowadays, I play more games like Slam Rancher and. What else did we play recently? Omori, right? Games like that I wouldn't have played as a child. I'm trying to be the older brother to my younger self that I always wanted to have. I want to be like streams feeling like I would have an older brother sitting with me together on a Sunday night, just playing together. An older brother to tell me about this game, talk about this game. When I'm excited to see what's going on. To help me how to play this game. Just being there so I wouldn't feel lonely. That's what I wish for during my lonely times. Of course it's just fantasies, right? But I didn't have such an older brother so... I want to give that feeling to someone else potentially watching this in the future. Those are the reasons why I'm here streaming. Well, why I have been streaming for three years already. And I will keep continue streaming until I really can't anymore. Even when I had no chatters at all. For the most of the time. For the past three years it was like 70% or 80% of my chat has been empty forever. For the longest time. Only one or two viewers averagely. And well. It felt like no one was there right? Other than some multiple accounts from my friend and partner. Just to keep the views up for some reason that I learned later on, which did make me sad. But I kept going because of the reasons why I started. Every time I feel down, when I look at numbers or anything like that, I always try to remind myself why am I even here. And I quickly get back on my feet. I usually never, never look at numbers during streaming, right? I'm just here, just here, doing my own thing. For my younger self, and for potentially anyone else who needs me right now. I don't know why and how you would need me, but I'm here. You're not alone. 
and I want to do something like this with ASMR as well. The content that I'm doing with streaming, I can't put it to videos like this easily, right? Streaming is literally the best way to know the value of my channel. And I want to learn and figure out where my voice is when it comes to videos. Because not many people look at streams. You could say I'm looking for numbers, for attention or anything like that. I'm looking at as the more people I can help, the better it is for me as well. I don't care if people don't comment, like, dislike, I don't care. I rather know that many people saw this and at least one person will like it. That's give me enough. If I made one person happy, that's enough for me to keep moving on. If I made one person feel like they would cry, being emotional and really feeling everything that I want to convey, the same feeling that I have right now, if they feel that, if they feel that grateful, that's when I'll be happier than ever. I strive for happiness and comfort for everyone, for anyone that is in need of help. I'm no professional, I am no professional at all, but until you can, until you can find professional help if you need that, I want to be here as a bridge to help you not to fall down the spiral that many people do fall. You are precious. Please keep moving on. You're not alone. Thank you very much for being here. Thank you for all your beautiful words. I read every single comment, every single message live. Even if I don't say them out loud, I do see them, I do read them. Your voice is heard with me. No matter how big I grow, I will take my time to read everything because you're never alone. Remember that. Reach out and something wonderful might happen. So, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. It's okay to cry. I don't even know what I'm trying to say at this point. <laughs> but, take care, okay? I had enough of a talk. I just got carried away. I wish you a good night, my dear. Sweet James. <laughs>